you guessed it, another statistics problem. Well, this one's interesting. There's no math involved. It's really testing what you know about statistics. Do you know the word of origin of population? Do you know how to use that in a sentence? I didn't think so. So let me show you how to define these words and, you know, problem solve and apply them to what is really going on in this question. So let's just read the question out loud. Uh, person in the front row, can you please start? Yes, you. Oh, I forgot. I'm talking to myself. Um, you wish to estimate the mean M of a population from a population of size N. Draw from the population. What the hell did I just write? Sorry about that. I think I was too busy having a stroke when I wrote the first sentence. Anyway, you wish to estimate the mean M of a population from a sample of size N drawn from the population. Whoa, that's a lot of words going on. For the sample, the mean is X and the standard deviation is S. The probable accuracy of the estimate improves with an increase in Increase in what? What does that even all mean? Let me draw out a picture for you. If you don't, if you're never drawing a picture, there's always something going to be wrong in your answer. So let me tell you, this is the population. This is the true population, and we have you know all these people right here. You know, let's say they're all these are people with yes or no answers. Maybe they're like, yes, I'm going to take the FE exam, or no way in hell I'm going to take that FE exam. You know, these all these people have their individual binary answers to that question, and let's say this is the the full population of those people thinking about taking that exam. Now, the sample is a subset of this entire set. So let's say we take these four people over here and call that our sample. So this is going to be our sample, and this is going to be our population. Really, we're just define, defining things here, there, everywhere, uh, underwear. Um, but uh, it tells us that we have a standard deviation of S for this. Uh, which is S, and we also have a mean of X. And then over here, we have a mean of M. See, if you want to get better accuracy within your sample uh, mean or deviation or whatever, what you need to do is increase your sample size. Now that'd be, be that, that you're, uh, that's crazy talk you might be talking, but it's actually true. We're trying to find the true average of the entire population from our sample. And the only way to do that with 100% confidence is to test or take our sample size as large as the entire population. Now that's crazy. And basically that's synonymous to taking the average of the population, the entire set, not just a subset of it. So the accuracy increases based off that logic. Accuracy increases with an increase in sample size. So an increase in N. And that is the answer to this problem.